guys, it's me Purple Star and welcome back to my channel. So today is part hmm, 18, 17 of Let's Play the City University and just really want to say, um, don't know if I'm saying this right, Zelda Andrew. I cannot reply to your comment but I use Bandicam. Yeah. Okay, um, so Bridget is in her sleepwear. We're gonna change that to her outerwear. Let's check hello, she's probably crying right now. And let's see, where did Regan go? Um, hmm. Hello, I'm blind, aren't I? He's probably right there, isn't he? Wait, he's someone with a love heart over his head. What makes sense? Uh, hmm. Where are you? I wish you could like double click them and find them. Right. Can we skate on the pond? Not yet. Oh, it's too small. We can ice skate on this one. Where's Regan now? We want to ice skate with him. <laughs> we really don't know where he is. Okay, I did that off camera. I found him. Um, we work with friend in Garden Wooden, right? Yep, okay. Let's kiss him. Why did I make that noise? Okay. Let's see, is Kalel getting taken, taken care of? Yeah. And also, thank you to, sorry, I forgot your name, the one with the koala photo. Um, for the thing about that the babysitter had to take one of my things to pay for the cost of the thing. King, think the ball. Right, Bridget. And then I want to go out to, um, designer because I think we can afford that um and yeah we can eat um let me just see can we pick any flowers like they're probably hiding under the snow though just in case are there any flowers well I just don't think I can see them hmm <laughs> oh well we'll look when it's spring so where's the diner <laughs> is it yeah okay eat here with date only 18 simoleons which is very good i will be back when we are up so guys i was just um sorry um you know just speeding through and troy our ex romantic interest it's just you know Leaping into b -b 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 -b's, Andrew's arms, you know, and Aunt his wife is right there. But yeah, you know, Bridget Hannon just ate a rest at a restaurant. She will always remember the fine china, elegant food, and the rude waiter. They always get that. You never get nice waiters. Okay, let's just be really cute, and then we can go home and sleep maybe we can invite him home and he can no wait because he wouldn't have anywhere to sleep because the bed's like squished into a wall is Kala getting taken care of and yeah she should be getting eat, not eaten <laughs> she should be look and then he leaps into someone else's arm oh that's so cute there are both in like old people's clothes i said that last time but whatever oh it's a snowman how cute, and you're building another one, thanks. Okay, and then, I'm getting a bit sleepy, I should head home. Spending, spending time together was wonderful, I'd love to see you again soon. Yeah, that's cute, they had a nice day. The air smells fresher, the birds are twittering in delight, and you feel like you're walking on tiptoes, as if you might suddenly burst into flight, that date was incredible, cool. Okay, we can actually pay her. 
So she can't stake one of our stuff. Um, Kalel never got fed. That's okay. We can feed her on the floor and then we just head straight to sleep. Oh wait, Dink. Dink's lonely. Don't greet her. We'll just give some attention to Dink. Okay, I'll be back in the morning. Okay guys, so I was just like, you know, chilling, um, like checking out the Hannah household to see if any of them were out, and in fact Cecilia was, and I think she just got back from the hospital, and they had another boy, and his name is Roberto. Strange, oldish kind of name, but he's cute, um, let's see, um, hmm. I can't really tell too much. The eyes are, it's like kind of dark to see his eyes right now, but I don't know, he's really cute. Um, and today is actually Snowflake Day, if I'm right. Yeah, so later on the day, we'll have like a little party and we'll invite them over. Okay, so Bridget is waking up a little earlier today because Kalel is moaning, she wants her nappy change, or diaper, so we're just gonna comfort her, you know, Ugh, I want this work, um, so yeah, um, I also really doubt why she's crying, Bridget received a small holiday bonus of 1,026 simoleons, that's small, but <laughs> if you look at her work thing, she did good and like was it yeah i think it was on my seasons let's play and they got nothing and they've been working really hard so i don't know what's going on there and snowflake day has arrived share a friendly gesture with your neighbors friends or even to a stranger at the winter festival today is a day to spread some holiday bliss so i definitely need to upload this part like um after my seasons so yeah, I need to remember to do that, to not upload this to our record seasons. So yeah, I'll be back when the party starts. Okay guys, the party is just about to begin. We have ooh, we have the gift giving thing and our dining room table is out here. I deleted the parking space because it was in the way. And it was just family members, but apparently Arlo Bunch had to come. So he can go away. Yay, Cecilia's here! Yay! Um, Regan's here too, that's really good. Caden just got hit by a car. <laughs> and we've got the music going. Dinks. No, I thought it was going to greet people, but no. Okay. Let's greet our sister. I did invite Muggsy because, well, he is Kellel's daddy so he had to come but why did you have to come bye Arlo hmm well it doesn't matter because he's bringing gifts okay <laughs> and I kind of wanted Regan to move in today but I don't know if that's gonna happen because it's snowflake day yeah I'm gonna hug I think he's called a girl Cecilia and Colby Let's say hi to Colby friendly maybe Ask about his day. What's wrong, Kalal? You're fine. Just play with the toy. And I bet Muggsy will just ignore her. He's trying to talk to us, is he? Hmm? It's a little crowded. And I invited Gabby. So, Arlo. Sorry, my phone just went off. Let me just answer that. Sorry, everyone. Had to answer that. I just let time kind of fly by. Um, we didn't get little Roberto to come, but that's fine. I guess we have to acknowledge Muggsy, so we'll we'll woo him. Okay, that sounds like we're trying to. I mean, like woo is in the party woo way, like this. If you're a party animal, you can do this. Go. Okay. <laughs> That's so funny. Regan, we're we going to. <gasps> we need a mistletoe. Oh my gosh. Sorry, my phone went off again. Let me go get a mistletoe. Okay, guys, so I searched, but I don't know. I think I'm blind. I just can't find it. I even went through like the filter content. So let's hope we get it as a gift. Um, uh, hmm. Let's we'll kiss him then. 
maybe we might get some mistletoe though as a gift and then after that we'll call everyone to presents sweet up sweet up sweet up okay call everyone to presents be exciting hope you get good ones okay everyone get your presents <laughs> I think we will have time to ask Regan to move in with us. Oh, Kalal's gonna need a wee. Come on, everyone. Just grab one. I put it in the middle. I moved everything. Okay. Nope. No one's gonna. Come on, people. Just walk up to the thing. Pick a present. Pick serious. Do you. Mind. Let's try and see. <gasps> okay, well done, Cecilia. <gasps> what did she get? She got nothing. <laughs> oh, she got a chess table. She's lucky. <gasps> Yay, Bridget's gonna get one. Hmm. Let's see. Please be mistletoe. Nothing special. I want to use it. What did we get? We got a umbrella. That's good. Next, poor Regan, Caden, and Colby. They're all just like outside. <laughs> Mugsy got, please not something bad. He got an umbrella as well. <laughs> Can we not, Regan? Please. Come on, guys. Oh, Cecilia's going again. <laughs> Did she get anything? Oh, she got something bad. I can't see what it is. Um, I can't see. Oh, okay, it's gone. Oh, we're going again. <laughs> what did we get? We Oh, we got something good. We got... We got a painting thing. We should make money out of that. Instead of selling it. Okay, thanks for leaving. We didn't like you anyway. Okay. And oh, we're getting another thing. Oh, thanks, Caden. Good thing you didn't get a gift. <laughs> um, we got a little lamp. That's cute. We can decorate Kalal's room with that. I really wanted to sell these though. Oh. <gasps> no. Stop it. Stop slow dancing together. No. Good. Step on his toe. Oh my gosh, our own sister. <laughs> okay, it's gone now. Let's break these two apart by... Let's slow dance with Regan instead. Cecilia, get off our man. Oh well, who cares about Kalil? <laughs> no, I'm not that mean. Um... But yeah, let's slow dance with Regan. It's cute. Please want to. Oh, why won't it turn the screen? Sorry if you can hear that, my laptop's kind of going mee. Oh, how cute. Let's see if I can get them spinning together. <gasps> Whoa! Ah, oh, damn it, I missed it. Because yeah. this was annoying me. My chair's making noises. <laughs> and then Colby's just like booging. What? Please don't leave. <gasps> no. Go <Get> back. <laughs> okay, um. I'll get him to move in later. Maybe we can. Maybe just chat with Colby. You know. Mm -hmm. Oops. We've got the tin. Did Cecilia leave? Oh, he had a pretty good time. Okay, so Cecilia's making a snowman in our back garden. Think are you okay? Why don't, why don't you talk to Cecilia? Friendly, another bug. Play chase. Play chase with her. <laughs> chase her around the garden. Okay. I heard bark. 
Andrews acted quite ready to toy Francis. They were like leaping in each other's arms like in this part. Okay, let's let's sort out Kalel and I want to uh, age her why won't it let me? I want to age her up. Um, mm, 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 mm. Huh. So if I've been calling this Christmas Christmas. I don't know if I have been or not. What are they doing? Oh, they're not talking to each other. Okay. <laughs> um, hmm. Maybe we will get like a birthday cake. It's kind of cute because it's just the three of them again. That's how we started this Let's Play. And they're all just here for Pacific Day. And Kalil obviously, but you know. I don't know. I think I am blind to not know where the mistletoe is, but what else? I'll use it in seasons. Um, oh no! 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 Bridget, you're not aging up. Colors. Oh my gosh! I don't want her to be an adult yet. <laughs> oh, she's stinky. I thought she was meant to change her. Whatever. Mm -mm -mm. And then I think what I'll do is I'll make this room into um, Bridget's room, and then this room into Kalel's. Yay, guys! Come on, yay! They're coming up. Oh, they had to make two separate snowmen, didn't they? Whatever. Yay! So it's Snowflake Day and little Kalel's birthday. So if we get to choose her trait, I'm going to make it Loves the Cold. But I don't know if I will be allowed to, because I don't know if she aged up too well. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Actually, no, she didn't. We're not choosing her trait. <laughs> Oops. Answer your phone then. Just answer your phone while the kids age up. It's Regan! We'll chat with him. Just while our child's aging up, you know. Go, Kalal, go. Yay! Colby liked our party, and so did Cecilia. Good for them. Think you're sleeping. Come on, you can do it. <laughs> Yay! We had an awesome party. <gasps> Yay! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, she got long legs. Um, we got the neurotic trait. You know, it's a very good trait. Very, very good trait. Let's check her out. Um, let's give her a new outfit. Okay, guys. Here is Kalal's new outfit. I know she had brown hair, but I wanted to give her more of a Bridget look. I mean, Muggsy. I mean, Muggsy. I mean, Muggsy. Muggsy. Uh. <laughs> There's nothing really good about Muggsy, so I don't want a daughter that looks like Muggsy. And I dyed my hair when I was like 11. It's kind of bad, I know. It's just growing out now. But, um, so she can dye her hair too. But yeah, she, she's very pink. Um, what little girl isn't? She, yeah. <laughs> um, Bridget, are you going to grab this last cake? Oh, don't get two. <laughs> Um, should I decorate the house? Well, now Bridget's in the way. Do you mind? Oh, and Kalel's gonna eat that. How am I supposed to decorate the house? Um, let's just... I don't know. I'll decorate it. Okay, guys, so I was just, um, you know, looking through the inventory to see if I could get any money, and... I just found a bunch of books that like were like a thousand pounds per book. So yeah, that's where I got all the money from. I just wanted to put that out there before you thought I cheated. So guys, um, that was really weird. So, um, here's the new house. Um, whoop, she has no more hair. <laughs> she shaves it off in the shower. Um, this is Bridget's room. It's all plain, it doesn't have the big butterfly rug. Um, then people will yep. 
yeah, we can afford that now. We have a lot of money because um, all this stuff in Britain, um, inventory, really cost a lot. I mean, I was surprised. Like, yeah, I did not cheat like I showed you earlier. Um, so yeah, Bridget's room is so plain, but they still have those cute photos we took with Regan, and, and like, you can see her fake nails. I thought they would like glitch out and not show up, but yeah, that's her room, and then this is just like a thing that wouldn't fit in little Kalel's room, but it is pink to the max. Um, yeah, it's the wallpaper doesn't really match, but then I was like, too tired, can't bother, I need to go to a sleepover soon. Yay! Um, so yeah, she's going to be that arty little girly girl, so she has her lovely art easel that Bridget got from um, this gift party. And then she has a little horsey, a little pink horsey that matches her bed, kind of, um, toy, this little dresser um, with these lights that Bridget also got, which is really good. Everything comes in handy when you have a gift giving party. Um, and then, of course, a unicorn bed, which came since free pets, and a butterfly rug hiding under that. Um, yeah. I'm going to end this part here. It is now spring, and it's minus two degrees, which is cold. But yeah. Thumbs up and subscribe. Goodbye.